This is the 15th annual Coral Reef Cup. The Coral Reef Cup was started uh, about 16 years ago uh, when the SORC stopped running their One Design Circles on the Bay. A couple of the local sailors thought it would be a good idea to add uh, an additional regatta to the, the Jaguar series, which is now known as the Biscayne Bay series. I started out very small. We had like 12 boats and it's been building year by year. Uh, this year we had 41 boats registered, which is the largest registration since we've been doing this. So it's become a part of the uh, winter circuit for the Yachts class in Miami. This game bay is probably some of the most difficult racing you'll find because it has current coming in from three places, uh, plus a pretty wicked uh, tide chart. And then on a day like today, you have no idea what to expect because nothing followed the forecast model. So you're just out there taking what you get. This is the highest, you know, cumulative talent level at any sort of winter service in any possible. Today went uh, quite well until the third race, so we did win the first two races. After the two first places, the third race did not go quite as well. Bow one, five, and bow three, one. You're all black flag. Benji's two, seven. One. We were uh, black flag. Coral Reef Yacht Club is fantastic. It's great to see yacht clubs that host events that bring sailors, international sailors from around the world. You get to trade ideas and you end up becoming friends with people from all over, different cultures. I love that aspect of our sport. Of course, one of the preeminent sailing yacht clubs in the world. It really does earn and deserve that type. They run great events and they run a lot of events. And it's awesome that the members are as understanding as they are about us intruding on their parking lot and their docks and all that. Coral Reef Yacht Club rocks. They know how to put on a party, that's for sure. Glad to be here.